Hello, DMB. You are tuning into the Kickback with me, Diamond B. Frazier. We are live at Dragon Digital Radio. Today, I have with me from Self Pay Records, Anton 3100. Indeed. And then a little guapo. What's up with you? So we got PG County in the building. You hear me? Then we got VA 30, in the building. Yeah. So, hold up, hold up. Because I was told that you was the shy one growing up. But you, since you've been walking in, you've been talking at the mouth. So I broke out of that. Okay. Okay, how we get out of that? Mm. It came down from my men bidding all, all the goddamn time. <laughs> all the goddamn time. So I had no other choice but to talk my shit. Okay. <laughs> so since then, I just broke out of that little bad habit. Being shy, I mean, it blocks a lot of blessings. Because you don't know who you meet. You don't know who you run into. You got to come off strong. A lot of strong energy that you build shows a lot of character to everybody else. Everybody peeped that shit. So, okay. yeah, that's how I broke out of that. So how did you two meet? If you up in VA and you in PG, it ain't that close. Especially shit. my dog. Yeah. On the end, you with me, boss. Okay. Shot yeah. college, shoot game was awesome. Shit just clicked. Okay, yeah. so the CEO of the company like, hooked y'all. Huh? D man, he brought shit together, man. Yeah, okay. Nah. So is he from VA? No, he's nah. from the DMV. He's from the D. He's from Maryland. Yeah. Hold he's on, pause. I said, is he from VA? Mm -hmm. You said no. He's from the DMV. Hey, Do you not the define Virginia as a part of the DMV? I ain't seen none of that, but they, they don't even be showing us love like that. I ain't going to hold you. They be thinking shit sweet down there, but you know it's, what I'm saying? It's clearly not. Yeah. I ain't going to hold they you. They just come out there and find out. Segregate VA and shit. Yeah, I'm trying to bring it together. Yeah, I, ain't, I ain't got no problem with goddamn D.C., Maryland, none of that. I'm showing, you know what I'm saying? It's love everywhere. But I fuck with real niggas. You know what I'm saying? Everybody real. We can link up. I don't give a fuck. Where you from? Real shit. As long as you ain't on no bullshit, goofy, ain't broke. Bullshit. You ain't broke. Huh? You said as long as you ain't broke. <laughs> no, I'm saying like I'm saying in regard, you gotta make I mean, money. They, if you got you niggas gotta, around you, you make money so if I'm not around. getting bread, I can't hang. Nah, baby, that's not that's not the case. That's if you got no, broke I'm niggas saying, around you, you gonna be talking. broke ass nigga. Not the case. You got broke niggas around you. What you gonna do? You gonna be broke? You feel me? You gotta not surround yourself around niggas that's really doing you what they doing. Surround yourself on who you want to be in life. You want to be exactly. broke all year. You want to be broke all your life? You got to be around rich people. At, le at least somebody that's getting some type of income or got some type of Does the hustling. way you get the income mm -hmm. define whether you hang out with them? Or it doesn't matter as long as you getting bread? I ain't gonna you get money, you could, you could persuade any mother. That's not what yeah, I'm asking. At the same time, you niggas be them. janky as shit. That's not what mm -hmm. I'm asking. What you asking me? The way you get your bread, mm -hmm. does that define like who you're hanging out with? So I can be with some scammers who are getting money. Or I can be with people like Jay Z who have a whole business aligned. They have a bigger picture. Mm -hmm. They both getting bread. So as long as the person is getting money, is that where your head's at, or is it how they're getting the money? Okay, first and foremost, you are who you hang around. Okay. Regardless, if you hang around scammers, you are gonna be a scammer. Facts. You, you hang around a broke nigga, he going he he not gonna be making money, so he's not encouraging you to make no money. So Facts. you gonna be a broke nigga. Okay. If if you fuck around and hang with Popular people, that shit gonna rub off, and everybody gonna look at you just like how they looking at him, depending on what you do. You know what I'm saying? Like, people around you, your peers, they motivate you to do what you want. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Like, so who do you two hang around? I hang around oh. killers, drug dealers, robbers, <laughs> and real niggas. Okay. And, and and you know what I'm saying? And that's the life you want. And I'm not it's saying I'm not pushing it or it was it wrong though. or not, but you just told you. me you are who you hang around. I mean. So it's do you want to be better than that? It's not or even because this is the environment that you're in. Yeah. So I'm just going to ride with what I'm around. Exactly. Yeah, it's it's like the environment that I'm in right now. So it's like this is what I have to get used to until I run into the right people in order for me to put the people that I love that doing what I just named. I mean, shit happens. It is what it is. But so how do you I wanna, feel about I wanna, that? I want to take positivity towards them. I'm just living how I grew up, real life. Niggas ain't really had shit, so I had to go out and get it. So define like the way you grew up, like. Shit. I mean, it was just struggling. A lot, of, a lot of my family members was on drugs and shit. It's just like I ain't really have really a good role model in my life. You feel me? So my father wasn't there, but you know what I'm saying. I ain't never made that uh, excuse for anything. I just got up off my ass and do what I gotta do. You feel me? Mm 
Did you have to go the route that you did to get it? Or that's kind of all you really knew or felt like that's like the I feel easiest like, way to kind of get it? Yeah, just, I mean, being around my cousin and shit, like, free to rack, like, for real, for real, that's, that's who really, really got me right, you feel me? <laughs> got you in your yeah, mm-hmm. so yeah, so it's just, I just the started doing what I had to do. Is the people that get you in your current element. It, so honestly. where are you trying to be? The great I'm trying to be, be up. To be? Trying to be up. I'm trying to make sure all my niggas eating, eating good. The right way. Yeah. Well, you don't gotta watch your back. Exactly. And worry about that. But you. I mean, just you have watch, to watch. You have to watch your back regardless. I look, I'm just trying to be great. That's it. And define great. What it, What does that look like for you? If you telling somebody, if you telling me, demand. Diamond, I'm great. Diamond, I'm great. But what does and I'm gonna say, okay, you're great. So then what? What What does that mean for you? How is your life going when it's great? Stress free. I mean, it's going to be stress regardless, at the top or not. But in high demand, for one. So you want to be popping. Had the man, had he paid. Everything I do rubs off on whoever. It doesn't matter. You know how Drake, you know, just mm-hmm. dropped that little joint with a uh, block boy, JB? Mm-hmm. He got like got my man booming now out of Memphis. Facts. Oh, God. A couple days, he got like 21 mil. My That's mother. what I need. I need all that shit. Everything, everything. Like, I need I need all the money. Mm-hmm. I, need, I need to be able to put whoever I'm around on. However the case might be. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, if I touch that, shit turn it to platinum. Real That's shit. What I want. Real shit. On oh, Eddie. I need that. God's stressing me. Oh, I'm about yeah. to have a ho- old lady going to have a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> Lord. So, not to touch into specifics, but you did face some time. Yeah. Okay, so once you got out, did you go back to what you were doing or was it like nah or was it not enough time I, I mean, for you to make a real change i was i was i was just cooling for a little bit because when i got out i went straight to a group home they sent me straight to a group home in charlottesville so i don't charlottesville i get my love out that joint like people just fucking me out that joint but after i got out of group home they sent me back up my way i was back home and shit and then i mean it was just back to what i was for real for real because you're around the same thing but had you been out the way for a minute, you think things would have went yeah, a little I mean, different. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of glad that I ain't gonna say I was glad that I got locked up. You feel me? But it just made it just made my mind, brother. You feel me? It just I just stopped doing certain some certain shit. Like, hey. so it's a work in progress. We ain't yeah, all the way there, but yeah, we getting it. I'm still thugging regardless. Don't get hey, hey, hey. Yeah. I'm still thugging regardless. Why? Why? Always. So do you feel like as a rapper that you have to come from <laughs> nah. this hard backing? Nah. I mean I'm, that is the, I that's the, authentic. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't choose to live this life. You feel me? Like you live. But it, you don't man. have to continue it. I don't. But at the end of the day, that's all I know. And that's what that's we true. trying to do here for this. You know. We are gonna get you on the right. Yeah. We gonna get you right. It's one we thing. We gonna get know. a brother right. Jail time will change you. It can. It will. But the way the system is set up is really hard to really prosper and you kind of get stuck because it's like, Why all right, I got this hanging over me because jobs got to do a background check and it's like you blaming me based off my past. And now it's like, what can I really do? Yeah, same thing I fell on. That's why I just stuck to this music shit. <laughs> <I> swear. <laughs> so you don't have any, any other thing that you want to do. Let's say you get popping with the music and y'all end up where you want to be. And is it just continue music on, or you it's about to be branching off into other stuff? Like, what other things do you like doing? Just entertainment. Yeah. Um, branching off into clothing. Yeah, clothing like shit, for real. Um, okay. My yeah. own brand, probably property, buildings. Are we thinking big? Way big. Okay. I'm just trying to put the team on. I hear I'm trying that. To put everybody, <laughs> Baby, literally, everybody, on. everybody, 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 with everybody, 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 everybody that was with me from the beginning. We going to the club twenty deep. Yeah. You hear me? That's what. That's why let's get come. We ain't coming. My mother. That's, that's what we do. Uh, oh God, that's what we do. Okay. We, we go in the club. We fuck that shit up and we leave. And that's exactly. I mean, that shit fun. But mm-hmm. I want to do this shit from state to state, on the probably regular. from country to country. So who do y'all listen to? Y'all like trap rappers? Trap rappers? Like y'all like that gangsta? Okay. Yeah, I like all types. I, mean, I like to old niggas. Or like yeah, yeah, yeah. Boosie. Okay. Boosie. For real, like, uh, got, um, I fuck with Kevin. 
some niggas out here. I fuck with a couple rappers out here, like some. I don't, I don't. It's a lot of rappers out here right now. I don't know. First and foremost, Chief Keith is the greatest of all motherfucking time. <laughs> you hear yeah. me? Yeah. Sorry, nah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like nah. I've been rocking with Chief Keith since he started. It, that's a young nigga that got out them trenches. You hear me? Mm. Motivated. I was witnessing all that, all that little. You know what I'm saying? All that, all that bang bang shit. All, I, that shit, y'all, like, had me thinking, like, how can you get out of that and turn into that? Because he's right. in mansions and shit now. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Chicago rappers like Lil Durk, Meek Mills, Drake, of course, all that commercial stuff, I hear it. Okay. It. All right. Um, stuff from, uh, from, from R&B, too, because my mother and my, my sisters... Um, and they like they like bachata and shit like that too. Oh, you got that Spanish. Dominican vibe. Uh, it's okay. Yeah, that did. So when you make music, you gonna be adding that in there, or you already sooner or later. Uh, and when it comes down to like late on b like music, my sisters used to always listen to that shit growing up. So it's like something that just stuck to my mm. ear. Like everything, like from from reggae tone to trap. To rock. I used to listen to rock when I was a young young bull. Mm -hmm. Like I was on some weird shit. I ain't gonna hold you. Like when I was young and shy. I used to just tune into everything. Lil Wayne, all stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I branched Wayne. off into like new age shit, like like motherfucking money man doing this thing. Uh So y'all like Uzi new Bird. artists. Yeah. You Lil like Uzi the new Bird, uh Ghana. Let me see. Even even niggas locally. Yeah, okay. like flock. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. a, lot, that's my a lot of people don't want to pin on niggas from like you know what I'm saying? They don't want to show love. Knucklehead. Right. DMV, that's that's a problem with the DMV. Yeah, my thoughts for real. For real. So you don't think we're moving Q, towards? We don't move like Atlanta. It. You feel me? Atlanta got Shy love. They, they all pin each other on. Right. Boom, boom, boom. You feel me? Don't get me wrong. It's niggas out there that's not gonna fuck Be with yours. each other. But if you out here and we both like you say. Got down. We 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 pushing each other shit right now. Yeah. You feel me? We we gonna get more views. You feel me? If, if right. we all out here doing the same thing, then the fuck, we, we gonna take off. PG. We got hella talent out here, and niggas don't realize that shit. So yeah, it's time to start aligning yourselves with people who is getting it the way y'all y'all want to get it. Exactly. It, yeah, it's time to to branch off from these friends. Nah, I can't. Oh, I got to stick with my brother gonna, wrong or right. I ain't going to say I got nah, friends, but I got I'm brothers. I'm not saying... Friends. I'm not saying down your sick. friends, but I'm saying it's time to elevate because at the end of the day, you're never going to make it where you want to be if you're still holding on to people who aren't moving. Right. So I used to, and I never talk about myself, but I didn't... Okay. Mm -hmm. So I used to be in a position where yeah. I felt like as long as I'm doing better than my friend, mm -hmm. then I'm doing good. But I wasn't moving nowhere because they wasn't moving nowhere. So I was staying where I was at because they were still below me as, as long as I was doing a little bit better than them. That's oh, a true. sister was on point. <laughs> then when people that were doing better than me came around, I felt insecure. I felt like, oh, shoot, like, what am I doing? Mm -hmm. And I'm still worried about my friend. Now, if I want to take it to the next level, are you really going to hold yourself down because you're still trying to be with your mans? Look, a lot of niggas gonna switch when you start getting up. That's people, true. I I, I'm, I'm saying that shit right now. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying it right Falling now. Like a I ain't even up like that's that. That's what I'm saying. Why I hold on tight? Like, I get you. Like, this is who you came up with. This is who you've been around. But if people genuinely mess with you like that, like that, gonna they're gonna respect the fact that it's time to move on. Like, all right, bro. Like, I wanna see good for you. I wanna see you on that level. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna let you do your thing. I'm gonna try to catch up to you. Because now, like, I'm about to be looking at you as that's where I want to be. Mm -hmm. But people feel good. They love being around you when they're in the same position. That's true. You feel me? And I definitely don't want that for y'all at no, all. That's true. Thank yeah. you. I appreciate it. Of that. course. All right, so we're about to get into a segment called What It or Quit It. I'm going to give y'all some statements, and you tell me if you with it, that means you agree. Quit it means, nah, I ain't about that. Mm -hmm. All right? Okay. So this first one. Most men in the black community end up in prison because of single parent households, poverty, and lack of opportunities. Are you with that or no? I ain't with it. Mm -hmm. I ain't no. gonna hold you. I'm gonna keep it a bad with you. My folks been together for 37 years, through right or wrong, through the hardest times. Mm -hmm. Growing up, it was in New York. Tough. Bronx, New York, on top of that. So that shit hard. 
It's been times where my my sisters have mentioned to me like we done been through some shit that to this day I'm surprised that we're at this level because they're hustlers. Right. My folks, they all hustlers. So that that's that's one thing I ain't, I ain't I ain't with that right there. Yeah, I feel like it's not necessarily our fault. Mm-hmm, I know. You know, they designed it a certain way, I know. and we we just get stuck with our circumstances. Yeah, but you gotta stick to yourself and remind yourself. That loyalty is key. It's, it's really key. So Define loyalty. Not you, him. Define stay, loyalty. What does that mean? Everybody niggas, nobody talk wanna, about nobody loyalty. Nobody want to stay down. Nobody want to stay down. Define stay down. What? Give me an example of loyalty. not a personal experience, but just an example of where a person's loyalty can be tested. Hmm. Shit. You say no to a nigga. <laughs> you gonna you know, see what's up for real? That man, they gonna be like, man. You got so ain't gonna get his chest. Shit, Cause that's how you for know real. if he really fuck with you or not. Real shit. You can't take a no. No, in terms of what? Man, beefing. At the end of the day, like, even if I don't got it, I do. You feel me? I'm going to look out for my brothers regardless if it's my last. But you know what I'm saying? You say no to a nigga, nigga gonna feel some type of way. Kill. I'll be like. And then that's that's how you gonna feel like you gonna be like me. The fuck you supposed to be I'm my like, man, so why you moving like this? You right. feel me? Like True. that's how I look at it for real, for real. So for you've real. experienced that. Yeah. And do I you mean, keep it pushing, or it's like laying at the end of the day, this is my brother? At, at the end of the day, like I had family members switch up on me, so well, why 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 wouldn't I think uh, the, the next nigga, the next nigga wouldn't switch up? You feel me? That's true, at the bro. end of the day, I'm gonna watch. I'm, I'm gonna be on my piece of cues. Mm-hmm. Stay okay. true to yourself. At the end of the day. But, I mean, shit like that, I be getting over shit like that. You know, you beef, okay, you ain't gonna be beefing later. I don't beef with niggas, man. No niggas got beef with me, but, you Why know. they got beef with you? Niggas be hating, man. But what lie. they hating on? What you got that they don't got? I swear to God, on any way I love, niggas, niggas just pop out, hating on me out of nowhere. I don't even know, shorty. Boy. They just don't like you. They just Since don't like you. talking about right. And how you move mm-hmm. with that? I mean, if you got something, if you feel some type of way, then it's whatever. <laughs> it's whatever, like, it's whatever? Or it's, yeah, whatever, it's whatever, like, go ahead with that. I mean, I ain't worried about these niggas, but I catch you on public. You with me, though? It's whatever. I ain't water. It be, it be some hating ass I niggas, I don't, man. I don't do that talking shit. I ain't People just, it. look, they generate hate off of, uh, off of whatever chemical hits they body because me personally... I don't have not one hate bone in my body. Niggas right. be going out their way. Do that shit. You hear me? It's yeah. Black. And guess yeah, you what? Don't even got Prosper from that shit. They hate more. It. You it's blessed gay. up more. You hate on another nigga? Come on, man. Okay. Come on. <laughs> like, <laughs> you what you know. like? You like? Come on, man. I be looking at it. I be looking at it a certain way. Like, come on, bro. Tighten up. I For real. Feel you. All right, so the next one. Life was better without advanced technology. Majority of people I come in contact with can't have a full conversation without looking at their phone. Yeah, hey, I ain't going to hold you a lot. People addicted to the phones. Are you I addicted s- to your phone? Mm, I ain't going to say I'm addicted, but yeah, I like my phone. I'm right a- on you. Yeah. I'm with that shit. I ain't going to hold you. It's I'm like, dang, can we talk without you <laughs> grabbing your phone? Yeah, I ain't going to hold you. I ain't gonna Why hold do you feel like it's like that? Like, what, what, what are you missing? Why people can't I live in the moment? Because I can't vibe out with certain people. If I can vibe out with you and have a whole conversation with you, I fuck with your vibe. Yeah, it's yeah. simple. I'd, I'd be like this the whole time, all my fucking day. Like, so the minute somebody... I, I'd be like, and look off or some shit like that. Nah, but if I'm around you all the time, okay, it's cool. I'll just be on my phone. You know? I, I like to tune in a lot. Okay. On the low, I like to tune in. And just get off, you know what I'm saying? It helps my mind go. So like, can you, you know. have a full conversation without touching your phone? Yeah, it depends on who I'm talking to. Just like bro said, for real, for real. It depends. Yeah. If I can yeah. vibe out with you, I'm telling you. You put that phone away, huh? Solid motherfucker. I don't give a fuck about my phone. But you, on the other hand, you care about your phone be glued to your hip. Shit, nah, man. but nah, that's the uh, difference, though. I'm, I'm in I, between. Man, I've been, I've been to the point, like I said, I ain't, I ain't really never had nothing when I was growing up. You feel me? I grew up living on, stepping on dirt floors. You feel me? Ten, ten roofs. We rain coming through that joint for real, like real yeah. live on Eddie Ray, bro. Like, so I ain't really had no phone. You feel me? I wanted it. You feel me? Mm-hmm. And niggas, niggas try joking shit. You ain't got no phone. Do this, do that. So, yeah, like, I ain't, I ain't. Does that at the hurt? end of the day, did it hurt? 
when I was young, I took it some type of way. Like, I, I, I had anger issues, so I was always getting in trouble in school. It was, so it was just like, when you ain't got it, you know what I'm saying? I was going to school, not, not all types of clothes, you feel me? I, ain't, I wasn't dressing how I'm dressing now, you feel me? So... I'm just trying to make something out of this shit so I can glow up on niggas. Let niggas know what's up. You I feel me? At the end of the day, at the end of the day, I'm thugging regardless. You feel me? Like, without this music, you feel me? I'm still gonna be the nigga I am today. And I'm glad I went through everything I went through. Cause the struggle make you make you a stronger person regardless. Like seeing my mother on drugs and all that, like, it just made me stronger, you feel me? Cause that music shit will change you niggas, man. Stay solid. Oh, Stay motherfucking solid. My man knows what's going on. That's how exactly you're supposed to move. Oh, Don't let nothing change you for your character. Oh. So when you get, because I, I speak it into existence, so it's yeah, not true. if, it's a when. Yeah. When you get where you want to be, do you feel like your clothing and your jewelry will reflect Nah, Your I success. Even, I don't even care about none of that. For real, for real. I ain't gonna hold you. I just want to see. I, for real, I just want to put my mom in the house. That's all. I just want my mom to be straight, bro. That's true. She been going through a lot of shit. You feel me? I just. You feel me? Duh, I, I had to take care of my little brothers and sisters. My bad, bro. How you good, boy? But I had to take care of my brothers and sisters, so I'm just trying to make sure they straight. You feel me? At the end of the day, I want them to go on the field trips. I ain't going. You feel me? Right. I was too busy out of school doing dumb shit like. I'm not even in school like that right now. I'm, like I'm gonna, I'm going to all sides of school. I don't even go to school like that. I ain't gonna hold you. Like, but it's not, it's not even something like I fuck with school, but I don't. You feel me? Because it's just not. What me. is it about school that's like no? I, I, I think I got ADHD. <laughs> I, can't, <laughs> I can't stay in one place, bro. People be, get, people be getting on my nerves, but I don't like. I, right, I'm, I'm walking the hallways. I'm gonna leave. Go go get some eat. Something. I oh God, that's yeah, how I was. Bro, nah. school, oh, that's why I graduated by like. But like this close, when my mother had to take extra classes and get yeah. the fuck up out of there. Like, I don't like sitting there just being everybody motherfucking face all damn day. Oh, I had to step off. Niggas be goofy as hell when I drink. I finesse my way in that Goofy. Joint. I you know, feel you. That's my motherfucking way. <laughs> no, I agree with you. I ain't, you know, I graduate on time. Mm -hmm. I did what I was supposed to do, but I do completely agree with. I, I wasn't really with school. Yeah, for real, for real. Because it wasn't. My bad. No, you fine. We talking. You good. Yeah, I'm shy. Whatever you I'm feel. Good. But um, it was just like the structure of it. Like I felt like I was contained in this box. Mm. And getting out, I learned more about life actually being in life. Than I did when I was in school. Yeah. It's like my life really started when I got out. I don't feel like school really prepared me for much. Yeah, Other that's than dealing with gossip and beef. Yeah, you know, when that's I go that, in the public, I brush it off. And with the teach, like, with the teachers and shit, they don't really be trying to help you. Like for real, you serve people for real, like, like real life, like. It's right. in Virginia. Oh, who you in Virginia, it's a lot. Of, it's a lot of racist like, shit. Like, you feel like, me? Like, you know what I'm saying? Niggas don't really uh, teachers. It be, right. be on some goofy shit. Like that's teachers why I really started going. That's how I really oh, got kicked fool. out of school. I mean, I did, I did do some. I did some dumb shit, shit but fuck that shit. Not dealing with you. You did something dumb. Fuck. Stupid. Well, we I will was keep just that out. in I the was past. Yeah, I mean, I can imagine, like. You, you grow up and you just got all these mixed emotions and so much stuff going on. And it's like, how do you really channel it? Yeah. You know what I mean? So you kind of just, you just moving yeah. and just hoping it just fall in the right place. That's true. Yeah. But luckily, you know, you got your CEO yeah. that's going to keep y'all yeah. in we track. Y'all got moving. each other. Y'all moving uh, away from the people that's keeping you stagnant because right. I stamped it with what? I'm going to keep them in some new whips and new houses by the time y'all know it. So, everybody. Let me tell y'all this. From all my brothers. Mark hey this. 30, I'm telling y'all. No. I'm going to get y'all one big ass house. <laughs> one huge ass motherfucking Blessed house. Child. And I'm going to make sure y'all motherfuckers in there making y'all money. Yes. Yes. So, when y'all do get on and you got all your homeboys surrounded you, working. they all better have a job. They all they better ought to maybe do nah, something. They, nah, Ain't nobody be working on my mother. They're going to be working. That's what Ain't I'm talking about. Ain't nobody running no slouch. That's one thing. Whole hood jumping. I'm telling you, everybody working. My man Guap, he going to do it. My young Nick, he going to do it. I'm going to just I'm tell y'all this. Not everybody that's around me. I want that shit to rub all. All I bosses. That, I want that. The there ain't no boss. You can't be around them. That's, that's exactly. Have to, real bro, but off the strength of me, because I'm I'm so genuine. I fuck with everybody I keep around me. I don't fuck with a lot of people. And I, if I could vibe out with you, 
then then you good. You good mm. with me regardless. Okay, cool. That's it. But I don't vibe out with a lot of particular people. You know what I'm saying? So the people around me, they gotta win. W. <laughs> they gotta win. Try it fact. or not. I don't care. Mm. They gotta get through it. Okay. Cause exactly this, this exactly what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to rub that shit off. All right, this um, next one. You should never pay a DJ to play your record. If he or she asks for money, they're not interested in your music. Are you with that or no? At the end of the day, it's money and that shit. You know how to pay money down. But I feel like if you if you in your area, I don't feel like I feel like they should be showing love, you feel me? Mm-hmm. I can see if you went out to like you feel me? If I went out I ain't even gonna say if I say if I went out to Atlanta, I can see that, you feel me? Sliding like a but couple like, yeah. dollars, like, please. But, like, if we, we in our area, man, we supposed to show love. That's exactly what I'm saying, you feel me? You go out to Atlanta, they not going to gonna ask you to pay, you feel me? I ain't, well, for real, I don't really know, but they showing love yeah, by that motherfucker. They, they be introducing you, you to exactly. any and everybody. Like, exactly. Oh, let me show you my man. Exactly. Oh, yeah, exactly. Do you do agree? You think, would you pay? I mean, in this world, you have to invest in order for you to make the next step for real what I'm, from what I'm understanding that this is world, a very this, this is not a free country this is a free country it's 2018 it's <laughs> you gotta you gotta show these people that you're serious and for example money giving money is sacrifice that's this giving something away you guys so you have to sacrifice in order for you to make that lunch there's been times where I was just like beefy that I went to the club and niggas didn't want to play my shit did they you know, know did the DJ know you? Some DJs be knowing me. On my mother they be knowing me. Maybe they don't like your music. I mean, that's on them. That's their personal. So why opinion. they going to play it? Hey, they going they going to vibe with me saying. one time for the one time. One I bet you when they up they, they ain't playing me, they hate me. Watch. Yeah. Well, okay, yes. I do agree what, with you. That's why I if say, you get up, they will play your stuff. But you have to think about the people that's in the club. If everybody's liking this person that's up, I'm going to play it because that's what the people want to hear. I'm not going to hear it. I, I don't it really gay. listen that's to trap gay. music like that. For I'm real. more like Neo Soul. But if I know I'm in a room full of <laughs> trap dudes that want to hear that, I'm going to play it because that's what people like. I got But question. I get where you're coming from. <laughs> but you still got to do, you know, yes. But what if you do both? What if you do trap and that neo soul shit? Don't don't try down it with the neo soul. Nah, Stop no, no, with me. ain't no down it because I make music like that. Honestly, okay. I make mu I make music for all types of people. I right? mean, Besides, yeah, you, you got know. some DJs that's like, what I play is what I play. Crank it on the ass. <laughs> <laughs> no trap, none of that. Oh, I don't know about all that. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna end it with a positive note. Yes. I want both of y'all to tell me what your ideal life would be like like how would you feel mentally like what would your day-to-day life be like not whips and cars and houses not saying there's nothing wrong with that but aside from that like your day-to-day life like what is it like what would be like a really happy moment for you wake up smoke some gas you hear me wake up feeling powerful gas Feeling like they everybody <laughs> needs you. I am. <laughs> as soon as I leave this joint, ain't. <laughs> On God. Uh, Bad ass for that. So they uh, got rid of all the gas in the world. You good? Yeah. No. <laughs> they, got, they, got, they got rid of what? All of it. Geek it. Nah. get rid of some weed, boy. Nah. I'm trying to grow that shit. My niggas, niggas, oh, really, my niggas really want to start down. They, y'all oh, y'all really want to see niggas start down. They going to move to the lane for this real. Everybody going to be like, oh, God, I'm going to be hit. With my mother. Nah, I need you my know. gas, man. I'm crash. Yeah, the, the second week after, nah, I give it a week. I'm going to crash. Yeah, I'm lushing. I'm going to crash if I'm here to J. I'm a J. And I smoke at least like. Five plus, ten plus a day. My mama. Oh, God. I'm done. My mama. Oh, Eddie Gray, I swear to if God. I don't hit more than, <laughs> if I don't hit more than at least three J's a day, shit ain't good. Nah. Shit a drought. I'm Niggas a- either got their huff. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. I ain't trying to talk. <laughs> y'all want to talk if y'all ain't. Nah. If a nigga in the I'm, fucking I'm, drought, you know what I Niggas I'm get mad. too comfortable. Weed is around. If a yeah, plant, I hear plant, you. It ain't. If they don't feed my lungs, I'm going to lose my mind. What do y'all like to do? Do y'all have anything Get you like to money. do? <laughs> what? Get money. Smoke dope. 
No, y'all need to have some. I make music. Y'all like to cook. I love going out. I love to go on walks. You like the museum. You like shit. Like the museum. You like, oh, you like amusement parks. Man, what I like, do you like to do. I like to travel. I like to travel. Okay. That's what I want to do. Where you want to go? My a place I really want to go. I want to go to Fiji. Okay. Yeah. I'm trying to go somewhere exotic. Yeah, that that exotic. Women. Man, I'm All the bad joints. I'm, I'm, trying, to to I'm, I'm trying to go to Bor Bor. <laughs> 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 hey, look. Hey, look. Hey. Nah, but for real, I'm, I'm trying, trying to go to Cali. Okay. That's. that. Everybody trying to go there. But in the future. Cali's, but. It, I ain't never been to nice Cali. Cali has some gas from Cali, though. Nah, I ain't gonna hold you. That's one. That's something that's attainable. I'm back and forth with Cali. I love Cali. I'm trying to go out there, The atmosphere is great. San Francisco is great. They are very fashionable out there. They influence me a lot. That's what I'm they, talking they about. They got a lot of shit going on. Even the little old, little OT Asian jumps be out there <laughs> busting them in the Montclair. Boy, okay, look. <laughs> but let me say I this. Need that. You know what I mean? Now that we have created this, this image, this picture where y'all want to be, that's where we about to be working to be that. Yeah. So anything else that does not align with your goals... <laughs> Be kicking rocks. Yeah. Move to the side. Move straight I, like I, that. I cut off a lot of goofy shit. You feel me? That's what yeah, that's one I thing started too. moving. I started moving when I when I really when it, when this joint really started really like being serious. Mm. I started moving a different way. I started cutting niggas off for real, for real. just off the strength because I know niggas was janky. You feel me? I ain't really trust niggas like that. Man, for real, for real. Like you just gotta move a certain way. You you in this type of business. You feel me? And I'm great like, at reading people, so. Okay. I detect that little goofy shit, all that, all that like, bullshit that niggas be on. Yeah. But my brothers, they solid. I ain't gonna hold you. Okay. Regardless if they talk shit or not, cause that's what the fuck we gonna do. We gonna Gosh. stick to it, and we gonna make it. We, we gonna, gonna make it. So where we gonna find you, follow you, stalk you, all that? The real guapo. Fuck no, ain't nobody gonna stalk me. Pause. Go me, ahead. Cause what I'm alias. Matter, matter of fact, my Twitter. I don't know what's up with that joint. That joint geeked up. I don't even want to get on Twitter no more. I ain't even gonna make another one. Why? Wow. So Somebody not, hacked I might, it. I might fuck around and make another one. I don't know if, it, if they hacked it or not. I just got on it one day. They was like, oh, can't get on that joint. Yeah, that's okay. bullshit. Bugging. Twitter be on that fuck shit. Bugging. I'm like, all right, son. I was like, man, fuck <laughs> it. I don't even care. Twitter you can have bro, 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 man. He was like, man, what you doing, bro? You gotta get that joint back. And I'm like, yeah. Man, look, that shit, y'all like blew me. You I gotta get it back. I, my I, mama. I, I you got. Okay. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna take my shit one. on. Like, what I do? Get a new one. For real. I gotta put like three passwords on my shit. I, I don't even know what I did. Twitter. What I do, they banned me for my drink. Get another one. <laughs> Cause Cause the, I just, look, no, hey, look, get another Grave, one. I just made another one. What they do, the same damn thing. I don't know what I do. Well, get a new email. <laughs> they try, they try to Shoot. treat me like I'm an Escobar. Just. What? They try to strip me. Yeah, my and mama. where do they follow you? Uh, they can follow me on everything. What's the name? Anton three one. And that's Anton on everything. Anton three one hundred for my Instagram. See? Yeah. Right. Anton three one hundred. A N T O N E. Three one hundred, and for my Instagram is A N T O N E three one H U N D O. Okay. Yeah. And then for Instagram, it's the real Guapo. I'm you know saying if y'all can spell, but I spell Guapo G W A P O, okay. and then dot underscore. We got any music coming up? Any projects? Yeah. Any yeah. events? What y'all pushing? Yeah. Two two videos dropped within the last two weeks. For first and foremost, for the neo soul people mm. like you, right? I Good dropped vibes. a song called What's the Issue. Okay. That's a very smooth, elegant vibe. It's, got it's, vibe. On it's vibe. Oh, yeah. Then I dropped some shit for the street niggas. One up top. Yeah. It's one up top in that motherfucker. And what you got going on? <laughs> Man, I just dropped a video with Chicho. Man, he just put on um, producer joint for me. The, uh, the Haitian joint. I got another video coming. Me and, me and uh, Tino got some shit coming too. Tino live? Yeah. Okay. We got some friends. My mother. Watch. Tino got a song too. That's for the Neil. So yeah, I got Boy. um, I got some um. I just dropped me. We, we just dropped the drum with um, Young Crazy. Was, yeah, we okay. just dropped that VA baby. Go get that. That joint on iTunes. All, all streaming, streaming. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna have VA on lock. My mother and niggas don't come out VA. I mean, I ain't gonna hold you. I'm gonna keep it a band. I don't really see that much VA niggas cranking for Well, it's about he to be. He didn't change that. He yeah. changed that. Yeah. I, I ain't going to. I feel, I feel like one thing I fuck with our VA that's cranking like that is a Reggie Ridge. Reggie Ridge, he be cranking. He from um, Woodbridge. Yeah, Shorty be cranking. Okay. But um, other than that, um, 
Oh yeah, hot your hand. I'll be fucking with Shawty too. Oh, yeah. Shawty be cranking too. Hot your hand. I heard I don't know that. Yeah, well, Mama get hip. Yeah, After this, y'all hit. just put me on. <laughs> Alright, well look, y'all tune into the Kickback DMV. I'm Diamond B. Brazier, and you are. Anton three one. And you are. Guapo Swiss ain't my mother. You know what I mean? That's what I'm talking about. And they so are of self-paid records. We'll catch you mm-hmm. next time in the Kickback DMV. Like that.